Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to download Streams R Us to your Android device, NVIDIA Shield, and Mi Box. I will be using a Mi Box, but it will be the same for NVIDIA Shield and it will be similar for your Android box. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go down to Settings, and then we're going to go down to Security and Restrictions, and we are going to turn on Unknown Sources. You'll click OK and OK. Once that's complete, we can go back to the home screen. And then we are going to go to the Google Play Store. Once we go to the Google Play Store, we're going to go up to the left hand corner where the magnifying glass is. That is the search area. We're going to click on that. And we're going to either type in or speak to search and we're going to look for the downloader application. Once that is complete, we'll click search, and then we're going to scroll to the right and look for the downloader application. It's most likely going to be all the way down at the end, but it will be there. Once you find it, you'll click on the downloader application and click on install. Once the installation is complete, we're then going to click on open. And then the first time you open it, you'll see the allow or deny. Click allow so it can access the files it needs. Click OK on the quick start guide. And then the first thing we're going to do is click on the URL and we're going to download the browser for the downloader application. So we're going to type in browser.aftvnews.com. Once that is complete, we're going to click next And then we're going to click install. Once that's done, we're going to click the done button. And then we're going to delete the file since it is no longer needed. Click delete and delete again. And then we're going to go back to the URL. Click on it. Your keyboard will open and we're going to delete what's there. And we're going to type in targetcreates.com forward slash SAPK. Once that is complete, we'll click next and then we'll click OK. And then we're going to click the second option, the one in the middle, streamsrus.apk. Once it is complete, we will click install. And then we'll click done. And we will again delete the file since it is no longer needed. And then we can go back to the home screen. Now, if we scroll down to the apps section, you will see the Streams R Us application. Rather than accessing it from here, each time you open it, you should go to the settings area and then click on apps and then go to the Streams R Us file. Doing it this way, you will be able to clear the cache each time before you open it, which will do a little maintenance and allow it to run smoother without any problems. And then you could click on Open to open the application. Once you open the application, it will ask you for your username and password. You will of course need your Gears TV username and password to access this, you can go to gearstvIPTV.com. It's a great website. It is PCI compliant, keeps your info safe and your payment data safe. They have 24 seven customer service. Once you get your username and password, you will then enter it here and you will have access. I hope this video helps. Don't forget to subscribe. We will continue to add updates and tips and new apps as they become available. Enjoy.